good everyone and welcome to prospect channel tv thanks for subscribing to this channel if you have not please kindly do so by pressing the subscribe button thank you very much once again obasanjo hatiko saraki sanusi all know nigeria as an imposter as a president the leader of the indigenous people of biafra IPOP Namdi Kano has said former Senate President Bukala Saluki Saraki, the former Emir of Kano State, and CBN Governor Lamido Sanusi Sanusi, the Vice President Hatiku Abubaka and President Olishegu Obasanjo know that President Muhammad Bari is an impostor in Nigeria. Kanu stated this in a Facebook post on Sunday morning, claiming Buhari died and was replaced by a clone, Jibiri El Sadani, from Sudan. Okay, see what uh, is saying below. For those still unsure of whether it's Jibiri El Sadani or not, below is all you need to, to know to make up your mind. These are many more, but for now, these few points we do. First, Buari was officially about 76 years of age when he died. Before, okay, he looked very much his age, his old age. Plus, he appeared noticeable, frail and strief due to multiple organ failures that automatically a uh, claim his life on the other hand the jubilee you see today is about 50 years old and it shows in his uh, guts his vibrant steps and the smoother tone of his face skin and wrist the one you can't miss is the deformity in Buari's ear which is now noticeable absent how come Second, Buari has receding hairline on the front crown of his head, leaving the rest his hair brief to, towards the tray end of his life. And the hair became very scanty and near snow white. All this can be verified from his pre-2015 pictures. Now, compared to Jibiri, who has fully money of hair, darker hairlines, and now permanently spots a, a cap, which has refused to remove despite being repeatedly dead to do so. Third, Buari was Fulani, so he speak fluent full, full for day. He also speak our son. Now, this Jubilee does not speak fully for day, but speaks only our son which is only he resorts to speaking Aousa as a diversion. His time is challenged to speak. Fourth, Buari was a very tall person, noticeable taller than other known tall public officials, such as former Senate President Sariki, who now appears taller than the man claiming to be Buari Hakom. To explain this, Law Mohammed claimed that Buari appears shorter because he used to wear high heeled shoes but no longer wears them now on the advice of his daughter. Does this make sense at all? He asks another question. Fifth, since he claimed recovery from his uh, deliberately ailments and discharge from the London hospital, the, the man that now claims to be Buari has not been traveling has not been traveling to london for the mandatory post surgery follow ups why he asks again it is possible that uh, it is plausible that buari an old man who passed through multiple organ surgeries suddenly healed to the point that he no longer requires clinical follow ups in london especially now that international flights are suspended due to COVID-19 pandemic. He added this, he said, why you are uh, pondering the foregoing? 
more revelation will be made in due course. Stay tuned and stay safe, he said. You know, this is becoming uh, more interesting and funny too, honestly speaking. Even as Nam the Kano dropped this this morning, many Nigerians who reacted to the post was a kind of uh, trying to advise the Nam the Kano uh, Nam the Kano to stop all the rumors concerning the president Muhammad Buhari said because he himself is also dead too, and being a clone uh, from Sudan too. You see. You can recall that the Kemi Oluluye last week uh, claimed to that Nam the Kano died in Italy hospital, Italian hospital. Uh, since then, this has been the all the headlines. Okay, Nam the Kano is dead. Nam the Kano is dead. But funny enough, after two two days, she came out again to say Nam the Kano is not dead, but well okay it was it did not even take up to uh three hours she came up again with something like biafra we never come to pass over her dead body so these have been the issues of her grant even when she challenged now the canal to make a live video okay broker so that people will see that is alive she also claimed that the person on that live uh, broadcast wasn't Nam the Kano, that that person is a body doubled from Nigeria. All right. So what's your take on this? Do you really think that Nam the Kano is dead, being double body, double body from uh, someone else? Okay. You will leave your uh, opinion below the comment box. But before you do that, let's hear reactions by Nigerians. Who have reacted to this? Okay, someone is saying here, it is very clear, but we will say, who, who will say it? Only Nam the Kano, the IPOB leader, can do that. All right, somebody is saying here, rubbish. Now that Kano is dead, it's look alike take over. Who say you mock person with dead? Waiting consigned dead with uh, culture, religion, and politics. Every soul must test dead, and that is the truth. He said, somebody is saying here, Buari is dead, Nam the Kanu is dead. Now, can, can the dead speak? Who is telling us lies? Who is telling us the truth? All right, somebody is saying here, I will advise you to stop all this your claim of President Muhammad Buari's death because President Muhammad Buari is not dead. Now that Nam the Kanu is dead, you see, what goes around comes around. Okay, somebody is saying here, yeah, Nam the Kano is still alive, and uh, uh, Kemi Oluyi will suffer for doing this by saying that Mazi Nam the Kano is dead. Our leader is still alive. All right, somebody is saying here, yeah, go and sit down. I pop leaders are so dumb to see that uh, Nam the Kano died in Italian hospital. Okay, someone is saying here. Yeah, uh, my only advice for the IPOP members is to go and look for somebody uh, really active to carry on from where Nam the Kano is stopped because Nam the Kano is actually dead. But you people are just too blind to see it. Okay. Somebody is saying here, yeah, President Muhammad Buhari will laugh. And they tell you because person when talk say, Person not go sleep. He himself not go sleep. Now the Kano can they talk say president die. Now, uh, Kemi Oluluye say Nam the Kano die. So which person now will go come believe? I beg, make I ask this question, my brother. Is it true say Nam the Kano don't die? Is it true say Buhari don't die? Which guy can't be this? So everybody now now dead people and being cloned in Nigeria. God help us so. All right, somebody is saying here, I am just tired of all this. All these things are just going around. President Muhammad Bari died. Nandi Kano died. I'm tired. Please, I think you people should uh, look for something uh, better to talk. You people should talk about the Bill Gates vaccine that they are trying to make compulsory for every individual. Nandi Kano died. Bari died. Now that one consigned them, he said.
So hello guys, I'm going to drop it here for now. What's your take on this? I'm asking this question again. Do you really think Nnamdi Kano is dead? Do you also think Buhari is actually dead? Don't forget to leave your opinion below the comment box. Thank you very much for only stopping by. Bye for now. Mm -hmm.